The deserts of Africa are deadly. It seems nothing can live in the endless sand. But wait, here is something. It is a foreign legion patrol out to relieve their fellow legionnaires at the remote desert base of Fort Jean. But as a fort appears before them, something is wrong. There is no sign of anyone anywhere. A lone cavalry scout is sent ahead, but his shouts are not answered. The bugler is ordered to call out to the fort. But still, there is no reply, and the gates are ominously missing. Ignoring the danger, the officer rushes his men forward. Two men are told to act as rear guard. The patrol find that the remote outpost is mysteriously deserted. The soldiers take to their battlements. The cavalry gather below. Why is Fort Jean deserted? Before they can solve the mystery, one of the men shouts in warning. He has seen something. The officer above has seen it as well. Hostile Arabs are approaching. The Arab foes appear on the front. More join in from the flanks, screaming at the hated foreigners. The legionnaires are vastly outnumbered. Suddenly, the Arabs bravely rush into attack. The legionnaire cavalry close ranks and charges, determined to smash the attacking tribesmen. Suddenly, an Arab cavalry streams in from behind the dunes. The legion cavalry, now facing vast numbers of attackers mounted and on foot, are outnumbered and outmatched. The soldiers fire from above. The battle breaks down to a score of desperate actions. The Arabs are winning. The soldiers move down to hold the open gate area. More men fall. Then, just as things look bleakest, the foreign legion reveal their Gatling gun. Punishing their enemy with a barrage of bullets, no one can stand this onslaught. Realizing they are defenseless against this weapon, the Arab warriors break off the attack. As the Arab tribesmen stream away in defeat from Fort Jean, their leader turns back to the defenders with one last shout, we're made of plastic, we'll be back. The victorious legionnaires proudly shout back, we'll be waiting. Fort Jean is saved.